soda, pop, fizz, or as I like to call it, bellyache in a can. But oh, what a delicious bellyache it was. It's time to journey back to the land of big hair, questionable fashion, and soda pop so wild, it would make today's kale smoothie drinkers weep. 1985, a time of neon colors, big hair, and new coke. Coca-Cola, the undisputed king of colas, decided to rewrite its recipe. Bad idea. The backlash was as fizzy as their soda. Customers made it clear they wanted the original, not the new. Protests erupted, billboards cried for the return of the original, and just 77 days later, Coca-Cola caved. The original was back, and the only thing new Coke managed to refresh was our collective love for the original formula. Fast forward to the 90s, the decade of grunge music, sitcoms, and a clear soda from Pepsi. Yes, you heard that right. Crystal Pepsi was a transparent cola. While Pepsi believed in the idea, the public wasn't convinced. It fizzled out within a year, proving that sometimes we like our sodas with a little mystery. And then there was Surge, Coca-Cola's neon green, highly caffeinated response to Mountain Dew. It was like drinking a liquid sugar rush, a fluorescent punch to your taste buds. It was, without a doubt, a child of the 90s. We step into the 2000s, an era of reality TV, boy bands, low-rise jeans, and some audacious soda flavors. Let's start with Coca-Cola Black. It was a hybrid of cola and coffee, an ambitious idea, but it turned out people preferred keeping their coffee and cola separate. Pepsi was not to be outdone. They launched Pepsi Blue, a soda as brightly colored as a Smurf and berry flavored. It was bold, it was blue, and it was a bust. Just like the boy bands of this era, it faded away. However, the soda story didn't end there. Just like some of our favorite retro bands, several sodas staged a comeback. Crystal Pepsi resurfaced in 2015, giving us another glimpse of the clear soda. Surge made a triumphant return to the shelves, riding on a wave of 90s nostalgia. Even the infamous new Coke returned for a brief stint in 2019. It tied up with the hit retro-themed series Stranger Things for a nostalgic promotion. New Coke and Stranger Things taught us that what's old can become new again. Let's kick off the new millennium. With the turn of the century, Mountain Dew decided to go bold, launching Mountain Dew Pitch Black in 2004. This wasn't your ordinary soda. It was grape-flavored, dyed a deep, otherworldly violet. It looked like a sci-fi potion and tasted like a trip to a neon-lit alien planet. Rewinding to the 80s, Jolt Cola surged onto the scene, branded as the soda with all the sugar and twice the caffeine. It was our youthful, rebellious phase in a can. It became the unofficial fuel for late-night study marathons, sleepovers, and arcade game sessions. Every sip tasted like teenage defiance and sugar-infused adrenaline. Ever tried to bottle the essence of Christmas? Pepsi did. Enter Pepsi Holiday Spice. Launched in the winter of 2004, this was a concoction of traditional Pepsi Cola infused with a medley of seasonal spices. It aimed to capture the warm, festive spirit of the holidays. Some loved it, some didn't, but it definitely spiced up the soda scene. Next, we take a psychedelic trip to the late 90s. Orbitz was not your average soda. It was more like a space-age beverage from a 60s sci-fi flick. Packed with floating edible balls, it was part lava lamp, part soda. A mesmerizing visual experience? Absolutely. A taste winner? Not quite. Pop quiz, folks. What happens when a popular bubblegum brand tries to quench your thirst? In the 80s, Hubba Bubba introduced their bubblegum-flavored soda, a sugary drink that transformed your favorite gum into a fizzy experience. It was a treat for the taste buds and a nightmare for dentists everywhere. In the early 2000s, Coca-Cola took a detour from the traditional cola taste. They introduced Coca-Cola Citra, a citrus-infused soda bursting with the flavors of lime and grapefruit. It was a bright, tangy beverage perfect for hot summer days. Unfortunately, the tartness didn't quite hit the sweet spot for everyone. In 2017, Pepsi decided to spice things up. 
they introduced Pepsi Fire, a cinnamon-flavored soda that turned every sip into a spicy sensation. It was like downing a fiery cinnamon candy with a carbonated kick. It made some tongues tingle, but it didn't exactly set the soda world on fire. Now, let's shuffle into the 2000s with a little flavor remix, quite literally. In an audacious move, Sprite jumped on the remix culture bandwagon, a phenomenon that was taking the music world by storm. They launched Sprite Remix, a splashy series of sodas that splashed the original lemon-lime flavor with a vibrant tropical twist. It was an entire line of reimagined beverages, with notes of strawberry, Aruba jam, and tropical, each bringing a dance party right to your taste buds. This soda was a symphony of flavors, a carbonated cocktail that embodied the playful spirit of the decade. And just like a catchy remix, it had us grooving to its beat, sparking a flavor fiesta in every sip. But alas, like a one-hit wonder that loses its spot on the charts, Sprite Remix gradually faded into the background, leaving behind a longing for its bold and fizzy melody. Its tune, though lost to time, still plays on in our memories, proving that some tastes really do dance forever on our tongues. So there you have it folks, the sweet, the spicy, and the outright strange in the world of soda. It's a fizzy trip down memory lane, isn't it? From New Coke's infamous fiasco to the audacious Pepsi Blue, we've witnessed soda innovations that bubbled with promise only to fall flat. As we toast to these carbonated memories, let's also keep our cups ready for what the future might pour. Who knows, maybe some of these forgotten fizzy fantasies might make a comeback. After all, nostalgia is a flavor that never goes out of style. Here's to the bubbles that burst, the pops that fizzled out, and the sips we'll never forget. Cheers, soda lovers! If you enjoyed our journey into the fizz -tory of lost sodas, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more delicious trips down memory lane. Stay bubbly!